AI thinks potato chips are deadly, but we'll get to that in just a minute. Every generative AI image or video comes out, either has a watermark on it, like the Sora videos or uh, the Google Gemini images, or it's buried in their metadata. A study of all that metadata shows that Google is absolutely running away with the vast majority of all images and videos being created. It's 69% of all images are coming from Google's nano banana image generation tool. And over 74% of all videos videos floating around the internet are actually being created by VO3 or 3.1, which is huge for Google. They kind of jumped onto the scene a little bit late, and the fact that they've exploded to that level is absolutely huge. With that said, a recent study just came out that 14% of all fraud detection came from AI generated receipts over the last nine months. This is people filling out expense reports for work using AI generated images of fake receipts trying to make money off of their company. Uh, unfortunately, they're getting caught because of that metadata I mentioned before. So if you're going to do that, at least be smart about it. And like I said earlier, AI thinks that potato chips are deadly, but not exactly. An AI security system at a high school in Baltimore area actually went off and had a student handcuffed and arrested because he made a gesture like this with his hands while opening a bag of Doritos and it thought he had a deadly weapon. Goes to show that you can't trust everything that AI does. But what do you think about that? AI in a security system that's got that level of faulty and of all places in a school? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below.